Say, I will be good. I will be done. Say, I will be brave. I will be brave. Say, Mom is my favorite adult. Good morning everyone, it is a wonderful day. We are just getting ready for school. We have lots going on. We've got parent-teacher conferences tonight, which we're super excited to talk with Peyton's teacher. Yep. Uh, we got up early. We got up early. Mom's out of the gym right now. I studied a little bit this morning. Peyton and Becca woke up about 6.45 and wanted to practice basketball. They've been super into basketball lately, which I'm super excited about because I, I absolutely love basketball. In fact, Michelle and I were talking about how if it wasn't for basketball, we wouldn't have ever met. We'll have to do a live and kind of tell you the whole story. So I'm just gonna cook some breakfast for these guys and get them off to school. One little thing about cooking eggs is actually I like to put in a little bit of milk it actually makes them more fluffy and just I feel like they just taste better. I had a bunch of people ask for more hair tutorials. So one of my favorite ways to do Peyton's hair is in a three part messy bun. Kind of hard to comb through it when you're done. So I'd recommend doing it on a day that you're going to give them a bath after. But I love this hairdo so I'm going to hurry and show you how to do it. Make sure when you do your first elastic, you put it towards the back. So now we just do it again. Put our hair into another third. On the second section, do your hair elastic in the middle of the part. You wanna hold this one too? The last one, do towards the top of the hair that you parted. Now your hair will be in three sections, with this one closest to the front, this one in the middle, and this one close to the back. Now I'm gonna turn each one of these into a messy bun. Now we will have three different messy buns and we just have to connect them so we can make it look like one big full messy bun. I connect them by adding hair elastics to just hold them close together. And just like that, sweet girl, you have a very cute hairdo Wait, today. Am I done? You are done. Doesn't she look cute? I love it. I love doing this girl's hair. I love how patient she is with me while I do her hair. <laughs> so we hope that you guys learned something too and that you enjoyed this three part messy one. Okay, what day is today? Yeah, what day for pancake at my dog. Today, they are doing the letter P and they get to wear pajamas, eat pancakes, and have a pillow fight. Should we go pick out what pillow and your pajamas you wanna bring? Do you wanna wear your buzz jammies? Yeah! I just washed them last night, let's go look for them. All right, let's see, here's the top. Let's find the bottom of those buzz jam jams. Should we go find your pillow and we'll put your Paw Patrol pillowcase on because that's three Ps. Paw Patrol pillowcase. Let's do that, let's go find it. Where's your pillow? It's downstairs. You run downstairs and grab it, I'll find your pillowcase. You know what they taught? What? Nanas. Nanas or nana bread? Nana bread. So the buzz pajamas it is, let me see you. You look so good. Okay, B. I'm behind the smart car. Have a good day, bud. I just got Jay back off to preschool and I'm gonna run while I only have one kid 
and go swimsuit shopping. Our trip is so soon and I still haven't found a swimsuit. So I'm gonna go make that a priority. Today is the day. Remember when I went swimsuit shopping and today was gonna be the day, turns out it was not. Well, this is what I came home with. A bunch of stuff from the dollar section and that's about it. No swimsuit. I did get these cute shorts for Peyton, but no swimsuit. So I'm gonna go search online and try to find a swimsuit. Dad is home and we are about to head to Peyton's parent-teacher conference. All right, go get your shoes on, quick, quick. And Bubba's a little sad that we're leaving him. So I'm pulling out all the stops, bribing him right before dinner with this. Oh. What do you think? Are you kidding me? But you have to be that. extra good for the babysitter, Dill. You ready, girly? Yeah! Let's do it. So Peyton, what's your teacher gonna tell us? I don't know. Is she gonna say, Peyton is so nice to everyone? And is she gonna say, Peyton is such a big helper? Well, I don't know. You don't know that? No. I think she will. She's gonna say that. Are you a good helper in class? Yes. Well good, then she'll probably say that. You wanna go to the book fair? So we're checking lost and found because Peyton lost a pair of gloves. So how many have you done? Where's your name? I don't know. Be proactive. What does it mean to be proactive? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it means to do hard work, not just do the bare minimum. Go above and beyond. And instead of letting things happen to you, you make things happen. Yeah. Let's go to the the wall around right here. Oh, She's terrible. on the wall. Wow. Peyton, good, good job. Oh, I got my kitty. Hey, do you want to go check out the book fair? Yes. All right, let's do it. There's so much things. This and she picked one for her brother too. What did you pick for Bubba? Dog, Dog man. man. So late at night after we put them to bed, they can cuddle in bed and she can read it to them. That was the deal if we bought it, huh? Yes. Hey guys, we're home from the parent-teacher conferences. Peyton did awesome, yeah! like usual. She is awesome, awesome. We are ready for bed. We'll see you tomorrow. Remember to like and sub subscribe. Subscribe. Laugh and subscribe after me. Laugh and subscribe. Lots of laughs. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye, bye, bye. Dean, get out of the dishwasher. Hey, what are you doing? Um, Palmer. Oh, yep, that sounds like a bad idea. Should we get you out?